Fish in a popular Jacksonville Parks pond are a little fishy, as it were. They're unsafe to eat, according to the Arkansas Department of Health. It hasn't been restocked in about four years because of toxic levels of dioxin. But some people out in the water, no idea about that. KRK4's Rebecca Jeffrey speaking to a local woman who's been asking the city for years for warning signs out at the park. Rebecca? Yeah, they have Bob and Ashley. For two years now, the former Jacksonville, Jacksonville mayoral candidate has been raising concerns to city council members, but as there are no warning signs at the lake, her efforts have not been successful. And now she's casting out her concerns, hoping for a wider reach. A couple days a week, you'll find Christopher Price chasing his four-year-old son around Dupree Park in Jacksonville. And there's a lot to do. You can go walk around the pond, you can walk, play in the fields, and then you come out here. There's usually lots of kids. Another popular activity, fishing in the pond, which they've done too. It was relaxing. I didn't catch anything. Which could be viewed as a good thing, because according to the Arkansas Department of Health, the pond is contaminated with dioxin, a highly toxic chemical that can impact reproduction, even lead to cancer, according to the World Health Organization. Any amount is unsafe. Deborah Fulton is a Jacksonville community advocate who also ran for mayor. She's brought up her concerns to the city council since she tried to get the pond stocked for a fundraiser two years ago. They couldn't stock it because the fish would be contaminated and unsafe for consumption. According to Arkansas Game and Fish Commission, it hasn't been stocked for at least four years due to the toxic chemical and the pond's tendency to flood. But it's still attracting fishermen. They should have had signs out here four years ago. That's four years of people eating the fish out of here. That's four years of being exposed to the dioxin. Instead, the posted signs give no warning that what you're catching is likely more than what you're reeling in. Office, but haven't heard back yet. The dioxin levels of the pond have not actually changed in recent years, but the EPA changed the levels considered safe. Now, another water test will be performed later this year. You can find three other lakes with similar fish warnings up on our website, krk.com. Ashley.